No, no, countdown. As professional, we always do a countdown and a sound check. All right, All right. Think sound check, one, two, three, four, <laughs> countdown, five, four, three, two, one. Hello, everybody, and welcome to... <laughs> see number five? What are you to my intro, man? <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. You're funny, I, you're made funny joke. Yes, funny joke. High funny five. joke indeed. Uh, oh, so but seriously, that time. I think, think D-Max <laughs> Right? <laughs> oh, D-Mag is, is on the toilet peeing. d -Mac's peeing. Oh, oh God. He might be doing the dos, but I don't know. Hopefully not dos. Dos Please. might be no. dos. He oh, never know about the dos. dos. <laughs> Always back. D-Mac, you ruined it. <laughs> I'm recording. <laughs> okay, right, everyone records, right? Yes. All right. Yes. Okay, yes. intro Good. number 1080. Yeah, but start with 3, 2, 1 and go. 3, 2, 1 and go. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Q8. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, five, just, no, intro just, uh, number 5000. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what are we doing? We're playing UHC, right? Should yeah. we just like corral us to the are intro? We, are, are we all here? Should we do a little head check? Everyone here, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, everyone's here. Raise your hand. Okay. Everyone here. That's fantastic. We can explain what's happening at last. <laughs> so, for this season, what we're going to be doing is playing in two big teams of five each. And these teams are going to be randomized, and then we're going to be separated into the world, separate from one another, and we have to find our teammates. So we're all going to be in team speak. however we're going to be in separate channels, and the idea is that you have to find your teammate on the map, walk up to them, then you can join their team speak channel. Yes, <laughs> throwing a book at me. <laughs> and, uh, and that's, that's the, the gist, yet. basically. It's UHC, two teams, but you've got to find your teammates. So you can see all of the settings on the side. We're playing with a world side of 2,000, um, 20 minute episodes. Hard difficulty mode with two teams. Um, you'll be able to see the other teams' names. It's going to be Eternal Day. Not chapels are allowed. Regeneration uh, things are allowed, whatever they're called. And uh, you can go to the Never. There's going to be a world border. It's going to shrink all the way down to 300 by 300 over two hours. And there's no level two potions allowed as well. So no glowstone for potions. And I think that is everything that we need to know. So is everyone here ready to go? Did I miss anything? Did I get it all? No, we're, we're good. good. I think he's got it. I think he's got it. Yay. Okay, so that was about the fifth or sixth time that we actually did that. <laughs> and now we can, we can start the game, right? Everyone's here. Mm -hmm. This time it's going to work. So we're going to randomize the teams. So when you've got, you know, your team color, I don't know, <laughs> see what team you're on. There we go. That was quick. Oh. What, what team? Oh, what team am I? Oh, what team am I? Oh no, it's for the team. Put Jerry on the team. Put Jerry on the team. What team am I? Slip Jerry. You're on my. You're red. Ooh. Teams aren't even. Corrales' team. Oh, oh I, I like this. Team. Still four versus six. Ford. Oh, I'm a blue team. It's 5v5. It's 5v5. We're good. We're good. We found it. Okay, right. So everyone, everyone, get on their little with their little teammates and uh, and just with familiarize yourself with who you're looking for. We're gonna get with our big teammates over here. That's, big that's blue the wrong team, team XP. <laughs> bam, 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 yeah. bam. Yeah. Forgot to look at my no reds so on the side. So everyone knows the blue team's on top because we're gonna win. Yes. Spoilers. Okay, guys. You die now. Ready to throw the book at them? <laughs> Throw down the book. Throw the book at him. <laughs> All right. I think we are ready to go now. Ready. <laughs> are you done? Are you done eating your book? <laughs> ready. <laughs> He's regurgitating it. <laughs> We're good. All right. Then, so let's uh, let's split into Green different track. channels on TeamSpeak, and then it will start. You'll be spread out into the world, separate from your teammates. So you've got to find them, as we've said about five times now. So okay. good luck, everyone. All right. See you guys. Good luck. World. Good luck to the losers. Hey. <laughs> Are you guys ready for this? And so it begins. UHC five. And this guy, you know what? This is one of the tricky ones. Because now I need to find my teammates. I don't have to find my teammates, but it would be kind of cooler finding somebody. I'm getting wood. I'm a professional at this game. It's been such a long time. But you know what? What the cool thing about this is? It's hanging out with your fellow hermits. I've missed them. Oh, have we started? Oops. I'm ready. <laughs> oh. I don't know. <laughs> you know what? I can have an advantage because I'm not really good at this game. So, everybody, it's been a while since I played with the Hermits, like Hermitcraft, like vanilla Hermitcraft. And you know what? I miss him. I've missed him a lot. Are we good? Are we good? Yeah, hopefully we're good. Because I'm doing it, peoples. Looky, looky, go! Oops. 
The only thing I kind of want to make is a sword in the beginning, because I think a sword can be crucial. Not a hoe. <laughs> I don't need a hoe. <laughs> but, and a pickaxe. I think that's going to be my crucial tools in the beginning. Look at me being all pro. Perfect. Just going to take this and run away. And a lot of people ask me about vanilla and the amplified world, world and stuff. And trust me, guys, I miss the hermits. I would freaking love to play it on there again. But the thing is, I don't really want to disappoint you guys. And that's the most important thing, because I'm kind of same bored still on, on vanilla Minecraft when it comes to like just survival and building stuff. I've been doing it for such a long time. I started playing vanilla Minecraft in like the first alpha stages of Minecraft like a couple of years ago. And even though they introduced new blocks and stuff, it kind of at some points gets a bit semi semi boring. You have to you have to like agree with me like I don't know. It's just it's just hard and it's like if I was a small channel, it might it would be kind of kind of like different. And let me tell... Oh, coal. I need coal for torches. Let's go for coal. Um, if I would be a small channel, I would I would maybe upload like all the boring stuff, like just mining and just doing like the all boring crappy stuff. But it's kind of like, as soon as you grow your channel and you get like a bigger channel, it's kind of like people have expectations, if you know what I mean. Hello? 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 <laughs> Uh, it's kind of like people have expectations, so I don't really know what you guys want to see, because I mean, just throwing out episodes of me mining, just grinding, because that is mostly what 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 survival vanilla is, is, is a lot of grinding and just get, getting resources. And I mean, one episode for me, it's not just because I'm lazy, but one episode for me could take... I make torches, look at this. Torch, 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 torch. Um, do we need more torches? You know what I could use, though? I could make some stone tools. I ain't cheating with you guys. I'm being professional. I'm making some stone. How much coal do I got? Seven coal. You know what? I'm gonna get more coal. Who is Gary Brano? He just left the game. Gary Brano. Um, yeah, but I'm just saying, like, you know, like, getting resources for me takes an episode. It takes kind of like five, six hours to record. And it's not because I'm lazy. I just... I just just don't feel the grind. What I want to do is just set up a freaking uh, fr freaking quarry and then just have it being like you know automated and stuff. And that's why I do play a lot of modern because it is like playing survival. Like I mean survival, but still it kind of like in a semi-creative mode. And I do enjoy uh, the mods of server, guys. Uh, it's it's just a fantastic experience. There's so many mods. And that leads me kind of to the next question from you guys, and that is... Hello? No, that is that is Attack of the B Team. I love Attack of the B Team. And I'm gonna do like a, like a final episode on it. Uh, but when it comes to the series itself, uh, it is kind of over. Um, I'm, I'm sorry to say that, guys. I know a lot of gonna be sad faces and everything about it, but... It, it just doesn't feel the same anymore. I mean, most people play those server have kind of like semi-quid. Uh, they don't really play anymore. And it it is kind of like... It's like kind of grinding, grinding and grinding there. And it's kind of like playing on a survival, survival world and survival aspect of the whole thing. And that is no fun. That is no fun. But don't worry, because there might be something around the corner waiting for you guys. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that. Uh, hopefully. Upcoming soon. So don't worry. If you guys enjoyed all that Tech of the B-Team, guys, don't be afraid. Something might be waiting around the corner. I'm not gonna tell anybody anymore. No spoilers allowed, alright? But... You just wait and see. So the question is, we are playing survival. I'm still alive. The... The world board is just here. Oh, holy crap, Aroni. I need to move out. I need to move out. I haven't even checked my coordinates. How is he shrinking? Furnace, you be quick now. Because the world board is shrinking. Oh, dang it. It's like I can see it moving towards me. <laughs> can it be because it's shrinking, grass? Let's take this and run away, alright? And Torch, you come with me. You're gonna be my best friend. So the question is, okay... Hopefully I'm gonna find any teammate and and I'm, I can talk to them and I'm gonna be like, yay, you're my teammate. What team am I in? 
I'm in team blue. Okay, so if I see red names, that means kill. If I see blue names, <laughs> friend, hello friend, I come in peace. All right, so so we're gonna see. But don't worry, guys. As I said, Hermitcraft vanilla is not over. It's just that I'm so freaking bored of it. Uh, I'm really, really bored of it. And I can't disappoint you guys starting a series and then just quitting after a few episodes because I don't really have the motivation or the, the, I don't know, just the creativity to continue and then just, just, I don't know. It's, it just feels bad, all right? And I mean, I could just throw out episode after episode, me just like doing this, for example, just going out mining, talking a bunch of crap. But that wouldn't be so entertaining. I know, maybe I say some fun stuff at some points, but that's really rare. So, I mean, you guys wouldn't watch that. So, therefore, at this point, we're having a break. You know what? I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm not scared. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I'm not scared. But I need to get out of from the world border because it's shrinking, okay? If I bring up this, uh, I should be pretty much safe where I am at this point. I'm going to kill some cows. Because cows got, got some meat, and I freaking love beef. So I'm just gonna get that little beefy here. It's kind of cool that I don't really see any other people's... Oh, oh, no! And we can't forget about this, but this is... This is, this is dangerous, everybody. This is freaking dangerous, because this is UHC. I die, I die. There's no respawn points. Well, there is a respawn point, but I'm out of the game. Which makes me a very sad panda. Oh, that, that, is, that is perfect. Exactly what I needed. Some Aiden. Holy moly. Uh, let me just get some blocks here on my hotbar. Where are they coming from? Just in case I... Oh, oh. Just in case I need to, like, climb and stuff. You know what? I don't think this cave was a good idea. I do like caving, but I just want some eating. <laughs> we get to find some eating. And what else is going on? You know what? I was about to uh, record Attack of the B team today. Uh, no, I mean, uh, Mod Sauce today. And then we bought a house in real life. And I couldn't record it for you guys. So I really feel bad about it. Well, by the time you see this, it's already been up on the channel. So, hey. You, you've seen it already, but you know, stuff like that in real life, it just throws me up at some point. And I, I mean, it's not like, yeah, it's not, not a big deal, just buy a house today. We've been saving for a house for such a long time, and it kind of feels like we want to get some bigger place. Oh, there is, there, I thought I saw a postcard. Uh, let's go in here. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, we've been saving for a big place for such a long time, just so baby K could get a nice place and his own big room and stuff. And we finally found one, so everybody's really happy. Like, well, not, maybe not you guys, but I'm really happy and my wife is really happy. And baby K, well, he just derps, so he doesn't really know much stuff about houses, you know, but he's gonna be happy, he's gonna be a happy panda, because this house has got like a little playground just outside. Like, behind the house, there's a big, big, like, uh, park area with a little pond and a playground uh, like a big big nice playground so bbk is gonna be oh no i hear bad guys uh, i don't want to be here anymore and now it started to rain so that means i'm stuck in this hole no actually not i'm just gonna do this i'm gonna put my furnace here in the wall because you know because we can i'm gonna cook up some stuff i'm gonna, also gonna put my crafting table here and uh, Meanwhile, what Dell cooks, I'm just gonna get some more iron because I can see some more iron. So what, what we need in the beginning phases... Hello? Hello, zombie, I see you. You see me? Perfect. We see each other. You don't touch me. Because I just got a stone sword and I don't want to lose any health. It's like he's not tracking me. I'm safe, everybody. I'm safe. Yep, he didn't really see me, so that's perfect. So let's just throw this in here, and that means we might have enough stuff for a whole armor set. And uh, yeah, I've been I've, I've been attempting. Hello, I've been attempting this for like forever, survival that is, and UHCs, and I've been always failing. So I mean, hopefully this time at least, I can have a little victory monument. Of me somewhere about that I've actually killed somebody because up to this point I haven't killed anybody 
I've killed cows, but I, I don't think cows kind of cows kind of kind of like count. But that that is about it. Uh oh. You know what? And let me just get this here. Perfect. That is kind of dangerous. I'm kind of worried about that. I'm not really worried about that zombie up there, but this is kind of dangerous because they can be just dropping down on my head. And I mean, who wants a, a creeper or a zombie on your head? Ain't <laughs> nobody. Oh no. Dang it, I need more wood. You know what? First off, let's make a sword just in case we get in, in combat. And that means we still got seven eating ingots so I can make a hat. I could make some boots as well and stuff like that, but I make a hat because now my head is protected. So in case something falls down from above, <laughs> I'm so safe. So so yeah, we bought a house. We've been saving for this for such a long time, and we're really really happy about it that we finally found something uh, that we really liked both. Because this house which we're living in now, we, st we get a house at this point, but this is a house which, you know, what, it was kind of like a hasty hasty decision to buy just because we needed really needed to move at that point so we just bought it and i i don't know i haven't really enjoyed this house that much because i you know it doesn't have the vibe which i kind of like one but but next place is gonna be amazing it's even got a freaking sauna yeah baby sauna so all those cold, wintry months in Sweden, I can just be there and just having a good time. Just enjoying. And outside the sauna is a bathroom, of course, but outside that is gonna be my, my office. So I can I can maybe work in the sauna or something. Holy crapper, the weather is not bueno. Weather is not bueno. Okay, that is done. Let's put in them. Those particles just scared the crap out of me. So yeah, that was the deal about Vanilla Minecraft and Attack the Bee Team and what's going on here with real life and uh, Baby K is gonna be happy because he's getting his. He, he won't really care, but but I will. There we go. And and by the way, you know, I haven't been able to live stream that much. You know, I'm just watching that all the time because I'm kind of freaked out about it. I'm just waiting for my stuff to kick up before we can move out. But... I haven't been able to rise for more because my internet connection sucks a lot and even though we live in the center of the town where I live and there's fiber all over the place not on the streets all right so I've been having like this crappy crap connection which I really can't really live stream much from uh, and stuff like that but the new place it's got thousand thousand oh oh hello zombie oh oh there's a torch oh 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 you know what I'm gonna kill this guy, mainly for XP, right? So if I just... Oh, what a derp. There we go. Come here, come here, zombie. But then again, I kill him, then his posse is gonna spawn, right? <laughs> now, now it's gonna become freaky. Now we're just gonna be waiting and see what's happened. Alright, so we got a lot of food. Well, not a lot, a lot of food, but we got plenty of food. Hello? Yeah, it's got thousand megabits up and thousand megabit down, which makes me happy. And that means as soon as we move everybody, there's going to be a lot more live streams. So just brace yourselves. I'm going to make a bucket and I'm going to fill that with water just in case somebody throws lava at me. You know, see, professional, professional Minecrafter. All right, so let's see this. We got some, you know what? Let me just get some more material here. I should, I should actually make some more. I should maybe make. I got, yeah, an iron pickaxe would be kind of glorious to make it, by the way. But what I want to have a little bit of more climbing material. I got one iron ingot, one chicken on the heel. So you know what we're gonna do? I'm just gonna go outside. And I'm gonna check on the wall border because I've died by that in some episodes, and that is no bueno. That sucked. That sucked a lot. So I'm just gonna get out here. So yeah, more live streams. Hopefully you guys really will enjoy, right? Hey, world! <laughs> Where is my friends at? I see pigs. They're kinda my friends, I guess. I don't see anybody. It's a big world, though. I see cows, and I love cows. Not really sure, I mean... You know that we can even go to the nether. That kind of that kind of semi freaks me out. I'm not gonna lie. 
that really freaks me out because I'm I'm gonna die there so I'm not really gonna go to the nether in case well I will go there if I find any good good teammates and stuff like that hello no nobody you know what one more crucial thing I'm gonna get some wood not with a pickaxe <laughs> with a stone axe all right perfect and hope that some apples will drop I kind of forgot about that. This is UHC. We need golden apples and everything. Huh. There's so much to think about when surviving. It's much easier to survive in real life. No, it's not. But, but still, there's a lot of thinking aspect to this whole thing. Hello? Hello, cows. Okay, you know what? Let's just be chopping down all the trees we can chop down. I mean, you never can have enough wood. Wood is crucial to everything. Mainly life. There we go, so we can build torches and stuff, and hopefully some apples will drop from those gorgeous oak trees we just chopped down, alright? If somebody kills me now, I'm gonna be so sad, by the way. That would be like the most failed point ever. I really didn't do any more torches though. There we go. Well, that's not enough. Bam. Bam, bam, bam. Perfect. I mean, now I got a lot of stuff. There we go. Like a professional. Come on, apples. Drop. Meanwhile, while they drop saplings and stuff, I'm just gonna be killing cows and random stuff around the world. But the thing I need to find is more caving. More caves. I need to find more iron. I need to build more pickaxes, more tools. No hearts show on tab. Oh, no one taken damage. Ooh, how does this work? Oh, so somebody takes damage, they're gonna be. Why you no drop apple? I mean, that was like three or four trees. Even more. A lot of saplings, shitty saplings. There's an apple, perfect. So we got one apple. And what is it? Is it gold ingots or was it nuggets? I think it's gold ingots, right? So, oh, more apples. So basically what that means... Why am I using this to chop them down? A waste of a nice... Are we allowed to strip mine? Oh. That's a good question, by the way. Because I need diamonds. Just imagine, Kiral is coming out. Oh, we can't strip mine, everybody. But I just want to find a friend. I mean, how boring isn't this? <laughs> okay, so let me just see here. This way is this way, this way. That is the way to the center. So, is it? Yeah, that should be the zero, zero axis I'm about there. So if we just continue that way, find a quick cave on the way, then the wool border won't really hurt us that much, I hope. No, I don't know. But hopefully that's going to be, that's going to be it. I really just want to find somebody. It's always kind of cool finding somebody because then you can talk to somebody. Otherwise, it's kind of like awkward commentary. Here we go. It's Kiralis. Oh, village. I shit you not, everybody. This is glorious. If I could get some stuff in the village. Well, there's not really much. Oh, there's a cave as well just outside the village. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. I can get some wheat. Make some breads. Just in case we need more foods. I'm not really sure we're gonna need some more foods, but just in case, everybody, alright? And I know I'm not, I know I'm using my, my, my sword to do this. Perfect. So we got that. We got carrots. <laughs> and potatoes! Or as the American would say, oh no! This this is the end, everybody. I'm gonna see you in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching and I'm still alive.